everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 1 Legendary Edition where we're trying to keep colonists alive and we're trying to kill creepers and it's it's uh, it's, it's, it's arousing good <laughs> it's arousing good time I hope they're saving because I whoa whoa they're behind me oh geez uh, I'm trying to fire doesn't let me fire Because you gotta like, I mean, it's not like super hard, but you gotta like know which which group is. Oh my gosh! sure you just don't like start blind firing because you might be firing at uh... I'm stuck move tally grenades thank goodness oh jeez I, I, was like, I, I was like I thought there was a freaking place you could you could get them from what positions.
Sorry, I'm waiting for it to come back. So I can push it. Oh, now I shot it right in the head. There's one still out there. Somehow, the uh, the entrance has been blocked, so we can't be crazy. Oh, that's so stressful! I hate fighting creepers and husks. They're my least favorite, even compared to like banshees and colossuses and all that. They're my least favorite. I tried to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trusted me. I mean, I have a nerve grenade. Stop you, but I won't. I won't. I mean, it's harsh, right? Like, I don't know. You can't. I don't know. I probably could have thrown a nerve grenade at him and like it would have been fine, but potentially not. Like before I could get the grenade out detonated, he might try to shoot me or already have shot himself. But he chose the way he died, even if he couldn't choose the way he lived necessarily, so at least there's something in that, right? That's what you say anyway. To make yourself feel better. But it's still a regrettable death. And like how like how would you feel like coming out of it maybe coming out of the mind control and like knowing what you did or what happened you know renegade zero paragon 32 well that's i'm glad i got zero renegade for that i think i did damage a colonist on accident like i think i shot one a little bit but luckily they're pretty beefy <laughs> okay, this part's gonna suck. Not this part in particular, but a part coming up. This is gonna be weird. Look, you can already. Uh, remember when I first came down here? I was like, la la la. Right, we fine. just need to find this creature and determine what it. What it. Yeah. Kila. What is that? <laughs> that does not look like any plant I've ever seen. This may be. problematic. <laughs> Hello? Hello, giant sentient brain plant, like an octopus with like different brain nodes. Are you okay? <laughs> hey look, it's got octopus tentacles too. A uh, green sorry. Your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. Mm -hmm. You gave something to Saren, something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them. Now. No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short. But have gone
gone on too long. Your blood will feed the ground in the new growth. See, this is what's like, no matter what you do, you can't convince the Thorian to, um... To treat with you, to, like, to not be, you know, to not end in a fight, essentially. Oh, I was trying to push her off the edge. Come on, Rex! There we go. Oh, I was trying to heal myself. Oops. Okay. <laughs> Apparently that was what behind me. Anyway, the Thorian is at, like, and we get to learn a little bit more about the Thorian. Come on, Telly. Why is Telly blocked? I need her ability. to heal but I can't oh my gosh oh my gosh I can't heal right now oh my gosh oh my gosh um, and shields don't do anything shields don't do anything shields don't do anything shields don't do anything no please off you go There we go. Oh, jeez. No, don't get stuck there. and they knock people over, which is super great. Stop it! No, don't touch me! I'm stuck! Oh, no. There's still one close. I'm like right by, I'm like right on top of the creeper, the Thorian rather. Whew, thank you for that shotgun blast. I was watching my death stare me down. Anyway, hang on, let's do... Like... What the hey hey, this thing. It's huge. And is like, we'll, I don't know, we'll see a little later, but it's ancient. It's absolutely ancient. Like. And I just wish we could have talked to it more. Like, I get, like, why it didn't want to, right? That, like, it's like, oh, no, I don't trust you people now because you're, like, Saren. You're ground crawlers or whatever, but... It's also... I don't know, like... It's such a brief chance to talk to it. I... in trouble like I just wanted to talk to it like it's is it yeah especially later when we talk else. Mm, I hate that I can't damage you like you realize what we essentially lost by uh, 
by having to kill this creature, you know? Just let me kill you. Like, at all. Like, that's the problem. Is... Oh, no, please. save every chance you get. I don't know if I kind of glitched her on the doorway or what, but I finally got her. It's the dang nab. So sorry, it's the worst. get like their limbs trying to use the stasis as like a last resort. 
I don't know how I did that technically. <laughs> I think I still saw it down there, but it's okay. Uh, let's see. Rex. You wanna don't, we don't have a better assault rifle. Oh, I'll take one, I guess. Shotgun. It's not that much of an increase. The pistol. Sure. Should do that, and then for her, we keep the healing one on. Yeah. Jeez. Ow, I'm stuck. I I can't move. I, this is this is actually garbage. I can't even fire. I was stuck on something. Oh, that's so frustrating. This game is bug. I swear it's bugged more in the Legendary Edition than it is in the original. Hello, butt. Now I'm stuck again. That's cool. Sorry, go. Did she die? No, she's down there still. Oh, great. Okay, we couldn't use Tally because she got knocked over for a second there. By the biotics, which the biotics are a huge pain. In the, in this particular segment, that's why I, when I see the SR, I'm like, oh, I gotta get her done first, cause she'll just she'll just knock you over and she'll overwhelm your dang nab. Wep she'll overload your weapons and stuff like that, but. I should stop. I should definitely stop. I think they activate. damage you do, I think they activate. This is, this feels 
unnecessarily cruel, too, you know? Like, it's just trying to survive. Like, it's very alien, right? Like, you just don't understand it, how it operates. It seems cool to us, but it's just how it survives, you know? And it's extremely intelligent, obviously. Gosh, I love shotguns, but I, I feel like I'm a little too twitchy for them sometimes. If it's another, sorry, I'm gonna, oh, you just got stuck, okay. Gosh. Save. How many more are there? Phoenix armor for Turians. I'm sure Garrus will just be pleased as punch. No, I've done. I've really, I've done with you all. position. I can't Fix itself. 
fixed it so well the audio not is just well did I fix it? Also, how do I have five med packs? Oh, Tally, wow. Oh, she did. Nice. Okay. Destroying, I think destroying the node killed the last two ones that were here. Maybe I, it might just be an XP farming thing to like let them live and then come in. I feel like that might be a thing. You can destroy the node and it'll destroy them, or you can farm the XP. We'll, we'll experiment. I don't think it's gonna let me save. I think we're too close to enemies. Yep. seems to require such This episode got a little bit away from me, so I had to cut it in half. So here is essentially the end, except for the little addendum of Patreon that we're going to have. So that cue that in 3, 2, 1. Hello everyone, here's the little Patreon addendum that I'm throwing into the last few videos that I've got. Uh, thank you so much, Scalamonger, for your sapling pledge. I appreciate it very much. And thank you, Reese Galito. Thank you so much. I, I really appreciate it a lot. <laughs> um, thank you again to both of you who are both sampling tier uh, pledge patrons, patrons, uh, and thank you to Christopher, who's a patron at the tree level. Um, so thank you all so much. Again, Scalamonger, Rescalito, Christopher, thank you so, so much. Your support really does make me very happy. <laughs> so uh, thanks again, and I'm gonna end the video here now. <laughs>